Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebrov. Now many Windows 10 and 11 users have the problem when they try to play any kind of game on Roblox, they get this error message that says disconnected, failed to connect to the game with error code 279. Now this problem mostly occur because of the unstable or the poor internet connection. And it can also be happen if the game server or the Roblox server is down. So the very first thing that what you can do open any of your browser and then you have to come to this website status.roblox.com once you type it hit the enter key and if you find the green color tab here it that says all system operational then that means there is no problem with the roblox server but in case if you find any message that there is a server down then you will have to wait and no need to do any kind of troubleshooting but if it says all system operational the next what you will have to do Close the game completely. Then click on your Windows search. Type allow. And in the suggestion you will be getting allow an app through Windows Firewall. Click on it. And here in the list you have to look for the Roblox. And if you get it, click on change settings. And make sure that all these private and public options are being checked. But if you don't find your Roblox game over here, then you will have to click on allow another app. And now you need to browse to the location to the path of the Roblox. In order to get the path, click on your Windows search, type Roblox player, right click on it, choose open file location. Again, make a right click on it, choose open file location. Now copy the path from the top, close it, come back, click on browse, paste the path at the top, hit the enter key and here you have to select Roblox player launcher.exe. Select it, then click on open, click on add, and the game will now be added. Once it's been added, make sure these private public options are being checked, then click on OK. And now next bring up the browser that you're using, like Google Chrome. Click on the three dot, or up to extension, then click on manage extension. And here you have to delete any kind of extension that you're not using or you don't identify. Simply click on remove. Do the same with other extension that you don't need or you don't identify. Once you are done, again close it. And now next make a right click on the windows icon. Then from the suggestion, click on settings. From the left menu option, click on apps. Click on installed apps. Here in the search apps, type Roblox. Click on the three dot at the right hand side. And then click on uninstall. Once it says Roblox has been uninstalled, click on OK. Now you can minimize it. Then you will have to come to the Roblox website. Click on any of the game. Click download and install. And once it get downloaded, you have to click on it. And the Roblox game will now be installing. So kindly wait. And now finally the Roblox player will be up. Now before using it, what you will have to do? Click on your Windows search. Type CMD. Right click on it and choose run as admin. The black window will be up. Now here you have to paste few command that you will be getting in the description so you can copy and paste. So the first command will be ipconfig space forward slash flush dns. Hit the enter key. Now the next one will be natsh space winsock space reset. Again hit the enter key. Once you are done, you can close it. Now this time, if you try to play any game, and now let's see by opening the same game and see if the problem has been fixed or not. Now in case if you still you get the disconnected error, then you will have to just restart your modem and restart your laptop or PC. So let me quickly do that. Okay, so the computer has been now restarted. Now before opening Roblox, what else you have to do? Click on your Windows search. Type Windows Defender. In this suggestion, you will be getting Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it. Now here from the left in menu option, click Turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off. Click on it. And turn off both the private and the public network settings. Once it's been disabled, click on OK. Close it. Again, click on your Windows search. Type Roblox. Right click on the Roblox player. Click on open file location make a right click on the roblox player 
then click on properties here from the top menu option click on compatibility and then here you have to check this option disable full screen optimization and run this program as an admin click on apply click on ok and now you can close everything so now this time if i search for roblox and if i try to open it i'm very sure that now the problem will be fixed and here i will go with the same game please donate i will click on play and here it goes so this is how you can fix it and i'm very sure by the end of this video you will go from here with a solution and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video bye bye